Slick Edit's Enumerate feature will put an ascending number on each line of a column or block selection. This can be useful for a number of things, including creating a set of flags. We'll also be touching on block editing, so if you've not seen it yet, you may want to watch the video Block Editing. Here we have the start of a set of flags that do not yet have individual names. For this example, we'll start by creating a block selection. There's a key bound for this in every emulation, but I'm going to do it by holding down the right mouse button and dragging. On the Mac, you can do this by holding down the Alt or Option key and holding down the left mouse button and dragging. Now let's take a look at the Enumerate dialog. Go to Edit, Other, Enumerate. Note that we can choose any starting number we want, and also the increment. We can also choose how many digits to pad the number. In this case, we want one. Finally, we can choose the kind of output we want. In this case, we want decimal. Now our flags all have individual names, but do not have values. We can fix this with block editing. We'll create a block selection using the mouse again. Type space equals, and then we'll go back to edit, other, enumerate. This time we'll specify a start of one, an increment of one, and a pad to number of digits of two, and select hexadecimal flags. When using this mode, the increment field is how many bit positions to increment each number. When we click OK, you can see that the flags were inserted and padded to the proper number of digits. We'll use block editing a final time to put a semicolon at the end of our flags. Download your free trial today. Go to www.slickedit.com trial.